So today we're going to talk about fascia and osteoporosis. Osteoporosis, uh, the loss of bone density, affects, uh, according to the International Osteoporosis Foundation, about 75 million people throughout Japan, Europe, and the United States. So uh, that, that's a big number. It's a lot of people. So as we get older, we all probably know somebody, um, and it may affect us. So as we get older also, our fascia becomes more dense and less hydrated. And fascia's role in the body, which is uh, many, but structurally, it shapes us and it allows the muscles to work and aligns us properly. But when we uh, get older and we lose the hydration of the fascia, uh, it becomes dense. And so as it becomes more dense, it takes over part of the uh, functioning of the bones because the bones become less dense as the fascia becomes more dense, okay? And resistant stretching changes the fascia to become more hydrated. Uh, we're going to send you out a, a, a stretch you can do, and you can sample it on yourself. What, what you do is you, you do three sets of 10 on one leg. It'll be a hamstring stretch. And then you want to get up and walk around and, and stand there. Uh, typically, over and over, people feel that the leg that they stretch is lighter. But after you do your stretches, stand on your two feet and, and feel how the leg that you stretch has more weight coming through your foot. In addition to being lighter and easier to move, uh, it'll become more weight bearing because you have just changed, to whatever extent you did, the quality and the health of your fascia through the resistance stretching technique. And now the bones get to be more weight-bearing, beside uh, better alignment. So uh, they're correct that weight-bearing exercises do help generate more uh, bone density. Uh, but if you don't change the dense fascia, uh, it, it, it may not work as well. So when you change the dense fascia with resistance stretching, simple exercises like walking and going up and down stairs will then become, uh, your body will become more weight-bearing, the bones will develop more. Uh, so, uh, just a thought, we'd love you to try it and, uh, we'd love your feedback. Any questions or suggestions that you have, we'd like to, you know, comment or, um, answer them for you. Thanks for watching.